Hello everybody, welcome to another video, and today in this video I'm going to be teaching you guys how to get um, mods for Beat Saber without uh, needing a PC or laptop. So first, to get before we get into this video, you do need some sort of Android, um, or you know, obviously if you have a PC or a laptop. This is not the video for you. This is for people that do not have a PC or laptop like myself in general. So, first things first, on your mobile device, you can have a phone or a tablet. You need to go uh, to. Oh, you need to go to unknown, unknown sources, obviously. But before, you won't see BMBF. So, you have to go. Obviously, do side quest, and you have to download side quest on you know, Google Play for Android. And download it. Then you want to stick your um, charger cable for your Oculus. You want to plug it in to your phone. So plug your headset into your phone. And then what you need to do after that is make sure uh, the green. It'll, it'll be green. And that's okay, then you're connected. Then in the search bar area, you need to go and search BMBF. And it should have a, um, like a unicorn. And stuff, it's kind of weird. Like that, right there. And you download that. Whoa, that's glitchy. And then the next thing you need to do is go after... You hit um, saddle load and it fully completes. Then you also need to search um, quest app version switcher and get that saddle loaded. So, first for quest app version switcher, um, you can get you can have mods for 1.25.1, uh, but I wouldn't recommend it because 1.24 does have custom sabers. In the last other mo other um wait okay yeah so the last version of Beat Saber that really kind of works is 1.17.1 .1. and uh, to downgrade first for Quest Out version switcher go to Tools and Options you need to make sure you you log in. And make a token, token obviously. Then you need to go to change app, and you know you'll see all of these. And you need to scroll until you see com dot dot beat games dot beat saber. You need to click on that. So let's say if I wanted to do maybe anything else. You can do that. You can basically downgrade any game that you want to. And make sure that's all you know, working. Then you want to go to downgrade. So if you're on quest 1, which I'm on quest 2, um, you want to go to Beat Saber right here, not demo. And go to details. Right? You want to go to versions. And you just want to scroll down, and you'll see these. Um, so, you manually want to download uh, 1.24.0, not 1.24.1. So download that, and it'll be download progress, and it'll pop up right here. And then you want to make the ba you want to make a backup, and you can have multiple, so you can switch to different versions of the game. So anytime you want to change to a different version, you just click on it like that, and then you hit restore backup and just download that. Okay, and once you have it to where Beat Saber 1.24.0, the downgrade is installed, and it's all good. Then you want to to BMBF and set. Make sure you install BMBF and let it 
um, just mod your game. After that, uh, you can go, um, if you want to get, you know, your custom sabers and stuff. Uh, here, I'll show you. You can go to your browser. I will link the link in the description as well. I have it bookmarked, so it's just easier. I will have this um, in the description for you guys. You want to go to game versions 1.24.0. Now, you'll see all these mods. You know, they're just your regular core mods. But then here are all the normal mods. Ones that I really recommend is definitely Chroma in any tweaks. Um, also, uh, my hit score visualizer like crashes for no reason whenever I go into the setting to change it. Um, usually, mapping extensions and noodle extensions don't work together, but I tried it and it worked both of them together. So, just get ma mapping extensions and that. Um, no particles, noodle extensions. I really prefer those just so it doesn't mess up the game. Uh, here are your cosmetics. So your boxes are obviously just the blocks. And it's your walls. Your Sayubes are the cubes. And your whackers are your um, your sabers. Now they were previously um, Q sabers. But they stopped it and made it whackers since the since the one point twenty four point zero update. Um, ca uh, counters really handy, and quest sounds. Um, basically any of these like slice details and slice visualizers so you can see your things. Um, streamer tools if you want to stream and stuff. Third person mod I do use to zoom out my game because my camera camera 2 mod won't work and then you might ask how do you actually like get these in game after you download them so on your bmbf if you go to your tools and on the top right it'll say this right here like it'll say htt p and then all this you just want to like go to your browser and search that up right there so like mine i i have all mine bookmarked so I don't have to do all that it's just easier then you can upload your files and if you go down to your downloads there should be all these just like your slice visualizer slice details you know all that um, your mapping extensions just all, all of your all the mods that you downloaded then once you upload them there will be a button Right here, that will say um sync sync them to Beat Saber, and you just want to click that. And then after that, I'll show you back in game. You also do not want to hit update now. You want to hit update later. Oh. Sometimes my beat some saber is not very fun. But once it does in fact load. You know you'll have this pop up. You don't have to select it anymore. If you previously have mods. Um, and then there's all these. You know you have this. Notice board here. Let you know all the updates. Uh, here are your other things. Like play 3D. Whatever. I move mine back because my FOV won't work. Quest sounds. If you have a PC, you can drag them in. Use whatever hit sounds you want. But these are the three. I just use the Bandu hit sound because that's kind of loud. I just prefer like a normal beat. Um, you can go to more songs to obviously download songs and stuff. But I recommend just um, going on your BM. 
just going on to your BMBF and going to beat saver up on it, it'll be on your it should be on browser you go to beat saver and then just search any song you want uh, modded online does not work with third person mod so you can't really use that obviously I, I use uh usually just use the LS Toast Sabers. And my game crashed. <sighs> Why is this video having to be so difficult? It's alright. Try to show you. Um oh wait, hold on. Alt um. I mean hit me. Please work. Care about the. Please. Okay. So. I don't know why, but it's just. Whenever I record a video, it's very glitchy. Like, my game's very glitchy. Uh, for mod settings, it'll be right here in your cosmetic settings. You can mess with them here your normal settings all that uh, I will I can show you my settings right now if you want to pause there they are if you would like to pause and get them there, here they are so now whenever you go to your mod settings uh, I'm not gonna click that because it crashed in my game, and I don't know why. A beat leader, I recommend getting, so then it'll be the leaderboard right here, and it'll show you, uh, you know, people just like the normal base game, but like for modern songs, no particles, uh, any tweaks, which you can change your graphics and stuff. If you have like a really good headset, I'd recommend Bloom. I'm not gonna use it because my the quality is just a little it's just worse. But these are what I use usually. Um, I do time to time use Bloom because it looks good with obviously the LS Toast Sabers, which you can get at his website lstoast.store. Not sponsored. Wish. Um, you know, and right here with the hand and stuff. That'll be your custom levels. Um, and all these. See if I'll play this. So, well, I have the killers I use. Uh, 255, 255, and purple. And then cyan, 255, 255, and zero up top. And then just like a gray and white, gray and white pattern. I hope to get out this will actually work for the video. Alright. Alright. Neem eens ze trek de stekker uit 5G. 5G, weg ermee. Kan uw hamster gewoon blijven leven. En nu de drop. Gloeiend heet. It's really, really glitchy, so it's hard to play right now. Gladde paling. They're just not very fun to do. Um, and your mods right here. 
or chroma. You know, you can have all this on. Uh, you can change your cosmetics and stuff in here. JD fixture, where you can just have your jump duration and stuff. Um, I use the accuracy dot notes, but you can obviously get more at, on the Discord. Um, I'll link that in the description as well. Hopefully. Um... Yeah, you can just get a whole bunch of stuff. Um, if you want a little bit better looking, I'd use take these two and uh, have them on. I use trail intensity all the way up for the Alistair Sabres. You can also look at all the songs you have. It's just kind of easier because you can just click on them, go to the song. That. And stuff. It also has the normal. It also show you the online. You can just go into click, click play like a normal game. And there will be people in here, obviously. And you can play mod songs. See? You can do that. And uh, you can also show what time it is and your battery percent. I find that very useful for long sessions on any, like on Beat Saber, so you can just know what percent you're at and what time it is. Um, this you can just do whatever you want, I guess. That uh, you still have all these. No, it's obviously 1.24.0, so you have the Escape Remix and the hundred dollars bills, the Camellia version and stuff um so yeah you'll have a whole bunch of songs uh, scary hour right here uh, it's my last video I don't understand I, mean, I got a copyright claim on it I'm not sure why it's kind of kind of weird yeah. Cleaner. Um, so yeah, there you go. That is, in fact, how to get mod on Beat Saber without a PC or a laptop. So it's gonna be easier for you. Um, so yeah. If you want to watch this video over again, make sure you have all the steps right. Go ahead. Um, not asking for subscribers or likes or anything, but I know a lot of people needed help with it, so I feel like this is at least going to help you a lot. So you'll be able to get mods on Beat Saber without a PC, um, but you do need Android. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video, and uh, yeah.